Hello viewers, welcome to Mad Tech. I am Amish Sharma. In this video, we are going to solve questions from 8 to 11 of chapter 5 from the book Contemporary Abstract Algebra by Joseph Galen. So without a delay, let's start. Question number 8. Show that A8, that is alternating group, contain an element of order 15. In order to solve the question, it is essential to learn the following results. Result number 1. A permutation f belongs to Sn that is called symmetric group is called even permutation if f can be written as product of even number of transpositions or if f is an odd cycle length then f is an even permutation. Result number 2. A permutation f belongs to Sn is called odd permutation if f can be written as product of odd number of transpositions or if f is of even cycle length then f is an odd permutation. Result number 3. Identity permutation of Sn is always an even permutation. Product of two even permutation of Sn is an even permutation. Product of an even and an odd permutation of Sn is an odd permutation. Product of two odd permutation of Sn is an even permutation. If f belongs to Sn is an even permutation, then f inverse is an even permutation. If f belongs to Sn is an odd permutation, then f inverse is an odd permutation. Since the product of permutation 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 belongs to A8. Why it is so? Because it is an odd cycle length. So it is an even permutation. It is again an odd cycle length. It is an even permutation. And product of two even permutation is an even permutation. And we know that in alternating group only even permutations are there. Now order of the product of permutation 1, 2, 3 and 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. This is equal to LCM of order of permutation 1, 2, 3 and order of permutation 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Why it is so? Because both are disjoint permutation which is equal to LCM of 3 comma 5 which is equal to 15 means order of this permutation is 15 hence A8 has element of order 15 question number 9 what are the possible order for the element of S6 and A6 what about A7 for S6 and A6 we have to find the partition of 6 the table shows the partition of 6 and element order First partition of 6 is 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 and LCM of this partition is 1. Again 2 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 and LCM of this partition is 2. 2 plus 2 plus 1 plus 1 and LCM of this partition is 2. 2 plus 2 plus 2 and LCM is 2. Now 3 plus 1 plus 1 and LCM of this partition is 3. 3 plus 2 plus 1 and LCM of 3 2 1 is 6. 3 plus 3 LCM of 3 comma 3 is 3. 4 plus 1 plus 1 and LCM of 4 1 1 is 4 4 plus 2 and LCM of this permutation is 4 5 plus 1 and LCM of 5 comma 1 is 5 and 6 and LCM of 6 is 6 this is the order of element in S6 all the entries which is written in blue are the even permutation why it is even permutation it is an odd cycle length so it is an even permutation it is an identity permutation so it is an even permutation and product of two even permutation is even permutation so this entry belong to A6 Again, this is an odd permutation because it is even cycle length. It is also even cycle length. It is an odd permutation and product of two odd permutation is even permutation. So it is belongs to A6. Again, it is an odd cycle length. So it is an even permutation. It is odd cycle length. It is an even permutation and product of two even permutation is even permutation. So it is also belongs to A6. Similarly, we can check the other entries. So for S6, the possible order are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And for A6, the possible order are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, which are in the blue color. For A7, we have to find the partition of 7. The table shows partition of 7 and element order. First partition is 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus up to 7 time. And LCM of this partition is 1. Now next is 2 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1. It is an odd permutation. Why it is so? Because it is an even cycle length. So it is an odd permutation. These are all identity permutation. So it is an even permutation and product of these even permutation is even permutation. But when we product of this even permutation with this odd permutation, it is an odd permutation. So this cycle is not belong to A7. Next is 2 plus 2 plus 1 plus 1 and LCM of this is 2. Again 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 1 and it is an odd permutation. Why it is so? Because this 2, 2, 2, 
both are even cycle length and these are the odd permutation and product of these two odd permutation is even permutation when we product even permutation with this odd permutation it is an odd permutation and identity is an even permutation and product of odd and even permutation is an odd permutation similarly we can find the other entries similarly here this 4 plus 3 is an odd permutation why it is so because it is an even cycle length so it is an odd permutation it is an odd cycle length it is an even permutation and product of odd and even permutation is an odd permutation similarly we can find the other entries so for a7 the possible orders are 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 question number 10 what is the maximum order of any element in a10 for maximum order we have to find product of disjoint cycle structure which is even whose sum is 10 since the product of permutation 1 2 3 and 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 belongs to a 10 why it is so because it is a odd cycle length so it is an even permutation it is again odd cycle length it is an even permutation and product of two even permutation is even permutation and order of the product of permutation 1 2 3 and 4 5 6 7 8 10 is equal to lcm of order of permutation 1 2 3 and order of permutation 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 why it is so because both are disjoint permutation which is equal to LCM of 3 comma 7 which is equal to 21 hence the maximum order of any element e10 is 21 question number 11 determine whether the following permutations are even or odd part number 1 135 part 2 1356 part 3 13567 part 4 the product of permutation 1 2 134 152 part number 5 product of permutation 1243 3521 part number 1 since the permutation 135 is odd cycle length, so it is an even permutation. Part number 2, the permutation 1356, it is an even cycle length, so it is an odd permutation. Part number 3, the permutation 13567 is an odd cycle length, so it is an even permutation. Part number 4, this is an even cycle length, so it is an odd permutation. It is odd cycle length, so it is an even permutation. It is odd cycle length, so it is an even permutation. And product of these two even permutation is again even permutation and even permutation with this odd permutation is an odd permutation so this is an odd permutation part number five this is even cycle length and it is even cycle length means it is an odd permutation it is also an odd permutation and product of two odd permutation is an even permutation so it is an even permutation thank you very much for watching my video if you like the content please do like share and subscribe my channel if you have any query, comment me. Thank you very much.